How's it going and welcome back to the Minecraft Survival Let's Play. Today we're going to be going to the jungle biome and we're not going to go by foot. We're actually going to use our nether portal hub, which during a live stream we set up a random portal and it teleported us to a beautiful spawn point in the jungle. So we're going to go ahead and work there in today's episode. If you like today's episode, don't forget to go and hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell to be updated and part of notification squad. So let's go ahead and load up our inventory with the supplies we need for today's episode i actually don't really have a big plan of what to do in today's episode for the most part i know that we're going to be working on a small little platform on a tree similar to how a, a tree house would look so we're gonna try and go with that so let's see what we need here um let's go ahead and use let's go get some lime green uh why the heck not and i do want to get some grass blocks we have plenty of this because of our beautiful silk touch um, and some core stir. I don't know why, but maybe we might need it when we're on our way there. Oh, we do need some seeds. Now, the reason why I say this is because during the live stream, we did run into a few parrots, um, and I want to get some seeds so we can potentially get ourselves another pet. That would be pretty cool to have a, um, a pet parrot. So, uh, I think we do have a name tag. So, I think off the spot, I'm just gonna name the parrot Jeff. Uh, I don't know why, but I think that's just a good name. So, we're gonna go ahead, and if we find our parrot, we'll name him Jeff. Um, and other than that, I think we have most of those resources we need. Actually, no, we do not. We need to make ourselves, hold on. We need to get plenty of sticks to make stairs. And I'm trying to figure out if we only have one ladder. Okay, we only have one ladder. So we're going to need to make a lot more than that. We're going to get some chests. We're going to get some jungle leaves and some more seeds. Why the heck not? Uh, might as well for the parrots. And we have some more of the interesting stuff over there. All right, so I believe we have some sticks left over down here. Uh, there we go. We'll get some, actually, you know what? Uh, we'll get ourselves another crafting table and some jungle stairs. But let's go ahead and craft ourselves uh, the most important thing, which is some jungle stairs, or some jungle fences. I don't know why I keep saying stairs. So we'll go ahead and put a few in here. I don't know how many we need, but I have a simple idea, and hopefully it works out to look kind of decent. Uh, let's go ahead. I don't, I made, oh, geez, I messed up. I always mess this up. Ever since they changed it, I've always been messing up the whole uh, set up here. So we have 15. We're definitely going to need a lot more. So let's just convert as much of this as possible. Here we go. And awesome. And by the way, go ahead and let me know down below in the comment section uh, what type of things you would like me to continue to work on in the Let's Play. If you have any ideas and feedback or build ideas, definitely let me know in the comment sections. And we actually might be building a room where we're going to have top comments on the wall. So that's going to be something I really want to do and feature it. And during live streams, we could do a top donation area as well. If you guys remember Mr. Quack, he was actually one of our top donators for this series. Uh, I think he actually donated over $100, which was insane so we actually built a um quack inspired or a duck inspired shield as you can see it looks quite lovely so yeah you know what? we're gonna take it with us we are going to take it on our adventure today let's go ahead and uh drop one of the things we don't need here and that is ooh, let's just throw let's see what are we done uh ladders oh we have to make ladders as well that is something we have to do uh, i don't think we need all this uh grass here and i don't think we need so many um i don't know let's see uh let's toss away the flint and steel Let's go ahead and make some stairs. I believe the uh, or ladders. I keep calling them stairs. Why? Why do I keep doing that? All right. Let's go ahead. How many do we have? We have ten. We're gonna need a lot more than that. Twenty-five mm, might might be enough. But let's keep making a few more until we run out for the most part. And thirty-one. I think that's a fair amount, decent amount right there. All right, sweet. Let's go ahead and go into our Nether Hub um, and get this place started. So the cool part about this spawn is it's actually not too far away. It is on the other side of this town. Uh, but luckily, it wasn't really a bad location for it. So I decided we're gonna give this a shot. I know someone in the comment section for the past few episodes has been saying to work on a jungle-inspired build area. So this is going to be the start of it, and let's let's not fail that epically. Let's get in here. And yeah, I'm looking forward to it. Now, this is going to be the first time I'm actually gonna be working in the jungle biome. So the cool part is I don't know exactly what I want to do um, for the whole theme of it, but we're gonna start working on it progressively. Uh, what do we have in here? We have some other cool stuff we got. Um, what is this, efficiency shovel? Some mossy stone. We might take that. We might actually take some cobblestone wall. And let's go ahead and get some more of the jungle wood. We have a lot of jungle wood, which is fantastic. All right, sweet. And I think it's this way. Yep. We also want to do some more stuff. We're definitely going to have to build our own house. Uh, this way down there goes to the, uh, I think, the desert town or the uh, desert biome town. 
And then over here is another random uh, teleportation we had set up, which actually brings us to another flat biome type style, which is okay, but I don't know what I'm going to use it for. Maybe some farmland would be kind of interesting. But as you can see here, this is the jungle spawn, and we did this during a live stream. If you were there during the live stream, you kind of have an idea of what it looks like. But for those who are not, this is going to be fairly new to you. But check out this amazing spawn. Honestly, this is, this is perfect because it's on top of a tree it's not all the way down to the ground and we can easily go ahead and build up here and this is the main tree i wanted to actually work on in today's episode because it's pretty much one of the tallest trees around here besides that one potentially that one right there is going to be something we might actually connect to and we're going to have cool pathways as well connecting to it uh i did bring my bed actually and we're going to place it right over here wait we can't no way i didn't know that all right so you actually have to have a block in order to place the bed. I thought you can place it on leaves, but I guess that's something I just figured out just now. So, hold on. There we go. I was I was really... That was bizarre. All right, let's go to sleep. We can get some rest before we start working on our amazing project. Oh, I do want to actually go ahead and get a parrot, a pet parrot, before we get really working on this. But you know what? Maybe we'll do that towards the end of the episode. Also, there is something cool I saw during the live stream. Down there, there is a village with some uh, crops, but I did not see a blacksmith area. But it's something we can definitely work with as well. So, uh, what we're gonna have to do, man, this, this teleport, uh, sound is really annoying, but, um, alright, let's go ahead and get something working here. Let's go ahead and put our crafting table. We're gonna have to do a lot of work here. For now, we're gonna set this area up like so, um, and we're gonna go ahead, we have plenty of chests, which I took with me. Good job, Alex. Good job, good job. Here we go, and, alright, so the first step is we're gonna have to make a lot of planks. Uh, I definitely wanna work with planks and the ladders, so that's one of the things. We're actually gonna store... Let's do this. Let's just throw everything we have in there and only use the stuff we need so it's not overwhelming. You know what I mean? It just makes life a little bit easier. So let's get all the jungle wood. Let's get all the uh, fences. Let's get the ladders. Um, and let's get all the planks we have possibly left. Some more jungle wood, jungle wood uh, stairs. And let's go ahead and grab some jungle wood leaves, cobblestone. It's almost like everything that we just put in there. Wow. R rest in peace. All right. So... Uh, this is going to be interesting because I want it to be a little bit higher up. So right about there would be a nice, nice section for it. So what I think what I think I'm going to do right now is just have a staircase starting to kind of work its way up. Like a nice little platform. Now, this is all going to kind of change in a sense. But for now, because we're still technically working on this area, I'm just going to try to incorporate the simple staircase. Um, let's just do something like this for now. I feel like that's that's kind of fair enough for a simple staircase and what we'll do is we'll use slabs so it's not like a weird uh straight up jaggedy uh staircase we'll actually make it look kind of interesting um and let's see how are we going to do this now so we'll have the stairway and we'll go up to the top all right we're gonna need some hmm, let's see we'll just i don't know if i want to waste leaves let's go ahead and grab some random dirt here coarse dirt um and just randomly put blocks under it so that we can actually put our stairs so let's go ahead and get our stairs. All right. This is the first time I'm working on this. So definitely bear with me if it's not the best looking um, start. But it will take its shape, I promise. Towards the end of the episode, it will start to take its shape. And hopefully it will look good. So let's actually remove this layer. And put the slabs right here. Let's go ahead and put slabs. We'll put two slabs. I think that's a fair amount. We did put one over there. But I feel like we can change it up a little bit. Um, and I don't know if I want the stairs to go spiral or if I want it just to be a staircase or ladders going up to the top here. So uh, this is still a work of progress here. Actually, hmm, let's let's try this out a minute. If we build the staircase going an L shape, then we could build it going straight up. And I think that's what we're going to do right now. So over here, we will probably take out the leaves here. Let's go ahead and knock these leaves down. We have our silk touch so we can actually still collect these without shears, which is quite nice actually, not going to lie. All right, and perfect. So we're going to try ahead and attach these to the wood itself, to the actual tree itself, to make it look more naturally blending into it. So um, let's go ahead and do that right now. We'll do something like this. That's kind of, that's that's a, not too bad. We definitely have to get rid of the dirt. We do not want the dirt just hanging out like that. Um, I do want to have some other leaves kind of just hanging from the staircase because it looks quite random like this, as you can see. But if we do something, maybe, let's see, let's try this out. Um, I don't know if I like that, but we can give it a shot. 
something a little bit random might work like this. And what we could do is put torches. Oh, you know what? I do like this. Because what we can do is we can actually use some jungle leaves and place them either on top. Yeah, that looks awesome. Yeah, that's actually great. So we'll have them on top. So this corner piece, we're going to have to really design it. Um, let's see. How do we want it? Like that, I think, right? So that we have that corner piece right here. All right, there we go. Oh, this is actually looking really nice. Um, and we will take down this piece here, this slab. We don't need that. And we'll put another staircase, similar to we have this one. But the only issue is it's going to have to be facing outwards. But I think we can handle it. And it's facing outwards like this. Oh, geez. <laughs> that would have been bad. All right, you know what? This actually works out perfectly. We'll be able to take down the dirt here. Because it looks really just doesn't look good at all. And it's an easy way back up in a sense. Here we go. It's not too challenging. But I am liking this already. This is actually looking quite good. I wasn't expecting it to look decent like structurally wise and, and uh, give it some landscape form. So I like that. What we can also do is we can add some fences maybe in between. I don't know if they would work like that. No. Nope. Take that back real quick. Let's uh, take that back. That did not happen. But um, let's see. I mean, does it work like that? I don't know. Not a big fan of that. We actually might maybe do that. That's actually not too bad. Because what we could do is we can add some torches, which I think I took some with me. Yes, I did. And what we could do with the torches is we can easily just put them on top. I like that. I actually like that a lot. So um, what we'll do is we'll put a fence over here, fence post over here. Same, same style pretty much. Only thing that's weird is that this side, it's not going to look as natural. But it doesn't matter because... You're not really going to tell. You're not really going to see that to that point. Um, so we'll put some random torches around here. All right. So now the main part is we're going to have to either have uh, ladders going straight up or try to continue this pathway. Now, because of the time frame, I think we're just going to have ladders going straight up for now. Ooh, we do not want to fall down there. Uh, let's go ahead and put the staircases down here. So we'll do another staircase here. Let's see how that looks. All right, I am liking that. That looks good. I like that a lot. And then we'll do the same here. Actually, we don't really need to do the same here. But just for... No, because I want it to blend in with the tree. So what I'm thinking now is we will actually, for the time being, we'll probably just have our ladder staircase going up to the top. And that way, eventually, we'll just reform it and put our nice pathway going up, maybe during a live stream of sorts. Uh, so let's go ahead and get some slabs. We'll make this a little bit interesting. We'll try to blend it in here. Um kind of with the surrounding so let's do this we actually want to take this down because it's another corner piece in a sense so we'll do that put a little bit of a bush over there i think that looks okay doesn't look too bad we may want to transform this corner a little bit differently but um actually yeah it doesn't really look too good so let's take this piece down here maybe we can work with some jungle wood itself let's try to do something like this all right not too bad Probably put maybe some slabs around here. Here we go. And then what we could do is actually, what I want to try is take this piece down and have a staircase. Let's actually do that right now. So this way it adds a little bit of kind of some interesting style to it. All right, that's perfect. And you can't tell really. So, all right, I'm happy with that. So right now we're just going to get our ladders and we're going to build all the way to the top. We're going to connect it to this side and we're going to go and see how this looks from the top here. Let's see. All right, that's cool. I like it so far. I really like working in the jungle biome, actually. It is kind of interesting. So we're going to remove these um, vines right here. Did I call them leaves earlier? I feel like I did. I feel like I did, but I'm not, I'm not entirely sure. All right, so we'll go all the way to the top here. Now, what we're going to want to do is I think we're going to wrap around here. Just do a quick wrap around with some slabs because that's the easiest form to get around. Let's actually test this out. If we go around here. Um, I think this is a good height. We might have to take down this little uh, section right here, or we can work around with it. I'm not entirely sure what I want to do with that. But in the meantime, let's actually take down these leaves and use the platform right here and start setting it up, I think. And what we could do is we can actually keep the logs that stand out and try to make it the branches, which I do have some jungle wood with me. So let's actually try ahead and do that right now. So if we do some random branches kind of working out here like so let's see i mean it looks a little bit odd let's take down 
that bottom piece and let's do this like that all right there we go so now what i want to try is this is going to be off the top of my head i don't know how it's going to look but we're going to give it a shot right now i think this is a good height so we're going to wrap around here and we're just going to do a full circle around town <laughs> just a full circle just so we can get ourselves a design kind of forming and kind of have ourselves a platform to work on because it's really easy to fall off over here all right so i'm going to try to keep it where it's a little bit not just a full square looks kind of interesting and this will be probably the first time i've actually built a treehouse now that i think about it um ever in a jungle biome so this is actually kind of interesting to try this out for the first time definitely go ahead and give me your feedback in the comment sections that would definitely help all right so this seems pretty symmetrical now we do have this branch which i, I want to work with it i really like the branch but i don't know if it's going to be much help for us now let me see if i messed this up or not okay i didn't we can actually put our fence posts so that, that's that's a good start so far. We definitely have to connect this area. Well, I messed that up there. Nice, nice, good stuff. Oh my gosh, mess it up again. Let's fix that. Continue on this side. All right, so technically this is in the way, but we can do that and then actually work our way down. Ooh, I like that. It's actually not too bad. Let's go ahead and get some rest real quick. But I am liking that. It, it does look... It doesn't look half bad, but we got to work with these. I mean, honestly, we might take down these uh, branches, but let me know down below in the comment sections if I should keep the branches or not. I feel like they're in the way, and they're going to ruin things in a sense, but they could add some uh, really interesting look to it. Who knows? But for now, what I can do is I'm tempted to just take them down so I can actually work this design how I want it to look, and then eventually we can just build in our own. So I think that's the better go-to plan. We're going to take down this uh, branch right here, and eventually, if we really want to, we can easily go ahead and just make our own new branch that works with the place a little better because this right here is slightly in the way. So we're just going to take it down. Here we go. Same with this side. And let's see if we can get that piece out. There we go. So that should go away by itself. Oh, ooh. Luckily, I got caught by the ladder. That's pretty good Pretty good luck right there. Uh, we have some food. Let's eat up real quick. There we go. And all right, so let's continue this, this design here because I know this will look kind of interesting when it's completely done. So here we go. Let's go across. Now we need to go. Mm, that's going to be a little bit small. Let's see four on this side right it should be four on this side that's even we can also take down this little piece right here we don't really need that we're also going to continue to make it a little bit bigger this is way too small for a platform so we might actually go ahead and expand it a little bit more on this side same with this yeah let's let's go ahead and make it one more here we go so we do have some space to walk around and we're actually going to probably add different levels to this this uh this little tree house in a sense um Let's go ahead and do that here. Oh, did we mess this up here? I think we did. This piece shouldn't be there. Or this one shouldn't be there. Hold on. No, this piece should be like that. Hold on. How are we doing this? How are we messing this up right now, dude? <laughs> All right. One, two. One, two. One, two, three, four. So one, two. One, two, three, four. So something here has to be. Yep, this side has to be expanded. Here we go. That's all it was. A little bit of a hiccup there. Uh, let's remove that piece and add it onto here. Here we go. All right, that's that's a lot better. So now what I want to do is I want to add the fence post. Now, the reason why I made so many was because I do want to have these going up by two on each side. And I'll show you why because at the end of the day, it's going to look kind of cool. It's going to have its little rooftop. Um, and I, I'm thinking it's either going to be slabs or stairs. I'm not entirely sure yet. So let's go ahead and do one more thing. So it's actually going to have to be one higher. So it's going to go across like this. Oh, there we go. Messed that up a little bit. But there we go. So each side is going to have its own little section like this. Here we go. Let me know what you think. I mean, it's obviously going to take its shape when it's fully done. And I have like a nice design going on. But this right here is going to be like the main windows. Because I don't think I want to have windows in this treehouse. I don't, I don't really think I need it for the most part. Unless you guys think otherwise. Here we go. All right, sweet. So what we can add is a slab over here. So as you walk up. And over here, we can make a little pathway going straight to the top of the roof of this treehouse. Now, the next thing we need to do is we're going to have to add, like I said, 
a little rooftop. So what I want to work and start off working with is potentially we can either continue with the slabs, which I wouldn't mind. Jungle leaves would just be too weird. It would be just way too much. So what I'm going to try here is I'm going to go for slabs on the top. So let's go ahead and try that. Should connect. Mm, it's not going to connect, actually. Hold on. Let's actually try this one more time. So if I go from down here, that should connect, right? Let's see. Yeah, there we go. All right, so let's go ahead and just make a little rooftop here. Now, I don't know if I want it to be symmetrical. Like, I like how this is a little bit uneven. So let's go ahead and do that. We're just going to make it a little bit uneven in, in some, some sections here. Like that. All right. Probably put one up there. Here we go. Kind of carry it across. Just trying some new things out here. Let's go like that. Bring that back down. Here we go. Actually, I quite like this. This doesn't look too bad. All right. But it is it is a little bit difficult because you got to make sure everything is looking looking somewhat symmetrical. It can't be just completely just random the whole time. All right, let's see. I think I think that's decent so far. I mean, let me know in the comment sections cuz I could be messing this up or probably not, who knows. But we'll probably do something there even though this might actually continue to go up. We're just going to continue the roof. To be like this let's go one there one there connect that back down let's go make this just go straight across here we go let that go up by one back down by one just make it a little bit interesting give it some some style actually let's see if that's good all right that looks good over there just close these in as so and you know what Let's do one up there like that, and one over here. I think that's even. I think that's even throughout. This side needs one, though. Here we go. Sweet. All right, let's actually take a look how this looks from the bottom view. Um, so far, we're definitely going to have to add some fences around here, uh, although I do like this entrance a lot. But that actually looks really cool. Um, I'm quite happy with that design so far. Um, definitely going to have to do something with the bottom probably gonna add some support beams because it can't just be hanging out like that but i really do like the way it looks mm, i like that that looks pretty cool i like that a lot all right sweet so we're getting close to ending today's episode so if you haven't already make sure you go ahead and let me know down below in the comment sections uh what i should do with the treehouse any more ideas you may have uh but what i want to do actually is we can even take down the middle tree now i can always add these blocks back remember that so I might even take this centerpiece down, right? And we can add maybe in the middle, like furnaces and chests and, and make it kind of open here. This could be kind of an interesting idea. Or better off, what we could do is we could do something like this. Hold on. Let's try something like that. Kind of a little bit of an interesting look. Kind of have some space in the corners. I don't think that's a bad idea. I think that actually looks quite decent. Um, and what we could do is we can add some jungle... Um, leaves to kind of fill up some areas uh i don't know nah not like that but we definitely have to decorate this interior for sure there's a lot more work to be done um ooh, let's see if we can do something with the cobblestone walls maybe even place them around like that no that just looks out of place <laughs> that looks completely out of place um maybe in the corners like that that actually doesn't look half bad all right i could work with that uh, we can add some torches in the meantime, or we can add maybe some leaves on top. Maybe we can add some leaves on top. I don't know if that's going to get in the way. But for now, it works for now. It's just a temporary design, just so we can kind of have some lights around here. Um, and what I'm going to do is I'm also going to add torches on the inside for now. Just so we can have some light when it turns dark out here and no creepers spawn in. But so far, I'm liking the uh, not completely even rooftop. That's nice. But it is kind of small, so we're going to have to really work with the interior a lot. So in the next episode, that's what we're going to do is we're going to work on the interior and really work it out to make it the most convenient as possible. But I'm liking it so far. So down here, just an easy way down, which we might want to add maybe even another level down here. I think that's a plan right there. So yeah, awesome. I just realized something just now. At the beginning of the video, I said I was going to go ahead and attempt to tame or get a new pet, which was a parrot. And I completely forgot. So yeah, let's go ahead and uh, get ourselves our pet parrot real quick here. Uh, oh, there we go. Yes, we have one. All right, sweet. All right, hello, buddy. All right, uh, let's see. If oh, 
best friends forever. Look at that. We have our parrot, and we're going to name him. Uh, oh, you know what I just realized? We have to go back to the anvil and actually name the name tag itself so we can get, get this bird his name. All right, but I wonder. Oh, what the heck? Is he on me now? No way. Yo, look at this. This is awesome. All right, sweet. Ooh, I like that a lot. All right. So, yeah, there we go. Uh, back to the end of the episode. <laughs> if you enjoyed today's episode, go ahead and hit that like button and let me know in the comment sections what you thought about today's episode. And if you are new, don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell. My name is Alex, and peace out and stay foxy.